Why do young people want to learn to build explosives? I think that desire is universal, like playing with fireworks or firecrackers. Most kids don't want to wage war or blow anything up. There's just something magical about being the cause of something exploding. There's something magical about doing so without hurting yourself when you know it could hurt you. I think this is the pleasure of being a cause. David Graeber wrote, as early as 1901, the German psychologist Karl Gruss discovered that infants express extraordinary happiness when they first figure out that they can cause predictable effects in the world, pretty much regardless of what the effect is or whether it could be construed as having any benefit to them. Let's say they discover that they can move a pencil by randomly moving their arms, then they realize they can achieve the same effect by moving in the same pattern again. Expressions of utter joy ensue. Gruss coined the phrase, the pleasure at being the cause, suggesting that it is the basis for play she saw as the exercise of powers simply for the sake of exercising them. Last week I put up a vlog about how to make these little matchstick rockets. I'll put a link in the description for a better instructional video about how to make them. I got a couple of comments from people who remembered making these when they were a kid, and that makes me happy. I think that mildly dangerous activities like these have a strange kind of value. Not the value of what you need to accomplish, like building a campfire might keep you warm at night or could have value as a means of survival that's that's not what i mean it's also just powerful experience to make that fire even if you're warm enough even if you could just go inside into the light it's pleasurable to be the cause of the effect of a warm glowing chemical reaction people want to be the cause of the stuff in their lives even if the stuff is trivial even if it's negative there's a kind of dark pleasure in causing destruction. Deprived of other options, these dark outlets of the desire to cause can become the only access to that pleasure. Science, engineering, these are much better outlets for the desire to cause. Sometimes they lead to useful discoveries, but in any case, it is valuable, like art or music. Dr. Robert R. Wilson, in testifying about the purpose of building a particle accelerator, said, New knowledge has all to do with honor and country, but it has nothing to do directly with defending our country, except to help make it worth defending. I'd like our culture to place more value on science for its own sake. <laughs>